I spoke with Ditter Bitter this morning, gentlemen. Uh, you know, he talked to me a little bit. He apologized to me and my community. So that's what I expect to see in this video as well. And he basically said that he didn't know all the fuck shit that was going on with Rot. And I said, okay, bro. I mean, as long as you apologize, we're cool. I have nothing against you. At the end of the day, this is another uh, consecrator trying to put food on the table for, you know, for his, uh, I don't know if he's married or whatever, but whatever he got going on. So that's all I needed to hear, bro. A, a respectable apology. And that's what it was. So let's see what this is about. All right. So I just got off a call with Odeblock to talk about everything that's happened the past couple of days. The first thing I want to make clear and that I made clear to him was that I was not the one impersonating him with the fake Oda DMM, Oda CC in bracket one. That was just Rot creating the CC in GE, mass recruiting as many people as they could, and I didn't know anything about it. I just joined along with everyone else in the final hour when we were told to do so, and I left it and went back to the original CC when I was told to do so. I do apologize for blacking it out in my video and hiding it when I left the CC, especially to Oda and his viewers who were wronged here. All right, chat. So he apologized to you guys and he also apologized to me. Okay. So the only reason why I didn't like what happened was is because some of you guys came in my chat and said that you guys got fucked over by me. Like somebody, somebody was like, oh, I thought that was you because you, some people were in bracket one and they thought they were joining me. But like, bro, that was not me. So I'm glad that got sorted. He apologized to you guys and me. Listen, I accept, bro. I'm a forgiving man. And not only that, like I said, bro, I'm not part of that cancel culture dog shit. I hate that. I hate cancel culture. I should have just included it in the video at the very least to show what was going on. It was like a three second black screen. I could have just showed it. So I do apologize a lot for that. Next up, I made it clear to him and now to you guys that I was only in rot for Deadman mode. They're the biggest Deadman mode clan and I just wanted to have the best chance of winning the finale. Many creators have done this before and gone with rot for different things over the years, including the last DMM with them and this DMM with them, of course, obviously. But I'm not here to try and like put blast on them or try to cancel them. That's something that's just always happened throughout. He's not wrong, chat. He's not wrong. I actually went with Rot last year in DMM. But you guys know me. I don't know fuck shit about multi, right? These guys know, you know, they've been in clans for years or whatever. And I just did some fuck shit and they killed me afterwards. And I never, you know, I, I, I never repped their clan or whatever. But all this fuck shit with Rot this year is absolutely just fucking crazy. Walla, no creator should side with them. Not one person should side with Rot and just completely shun them from the community. Like, just treat them like the fucking plague. Like, get out of here. Get out of here, you fucking sickness, you poison. Rot RuneScape. But I still do apologize. I shouldn't have been promoting it and giving it a platform myself. And no, I will not be playing the next tournament with them. I made it clear to Oda and now I'm trying to make it clear to you guys and he understands that I didn't have anything to do with what they've uh, done or what they said during or after the finale. I was literally just there for DMM what, and that's flashy? over. I wasn't doing any cheating or anything. I made all my accounts just to try and compete for the finale and record all five finales. And the last thing I talked to him about was in bracket two. The Oda, this is what we call crocodile tears. Listen, he came, he talked to me off stream. He was being a man about it. He apologized to you and, and me and you guys, right? That's something that I can definitely respect. I have nothing against the guy. I told him that we're cool. Let's see what he has uh, to say. There's another like minute and a half. The winner from EOP being in Oda's CC. Theo was added to the Runelight plugin, which basically shows everyone added as a purple dot, even if they're not in the CC. And because they had over 500 people, not everyone was in the CC. That led to Theo not being attacked by them. And because he was in the EOP CC as well, he was not attacked by EOP. So he was not attacked by 700 people. Now, this isn't against the rules. I mean, Oda agreed that this is multi, and that's what people do, and it is fucked. And it definitely fucked over all of the people in his CC who obviously would have been attacking Theo if he wasn't a purple dot, like if he was a white dot. But because of how the plugin works, they were wronged in that sense. So I am sorry to his viewers who are- What? No, no. Wronged here. But obviously there weren't actually any rules broken. It was just a scummy way of winning. But yeah, to summarize me and Oda- are Unfortunately, chat, them infiltrating us and going into our CC is unfortunately not against the rules. But yes, it is fucked up in a scummy way to win because we would have fucking won. They won under our CC, basically. It is what it is, though. They're cool. He knows, and I hope you guys can understand that the actions of Rot are not the actions of me. I've received a lot of just criticism in my comments and stuff, which is fine and understandable, granted everything that's going on. But obviously, some people want to take it a couple steps further than that with the racist comments. And then... <laughs> this guy said, don't care, Ditter. Never watching you again. <laughs> what? 
This guy just like, nah, bro, fuck off with that shit. A group of people take <laughs> this it. This motherfucker is not forgiven in the chat. He's not forgiven. And even <laughs> steps further than that, and just do some completely fucked up shit, which Oda said I shouldn't even address, so I won't. But that stuff is obviously just unacceptable. So I hope it'll stop over time, but you know, I guess we'll see. Sorry once again to everyone who I've wronged, and I look forward to moving past this and getting back to creating regular content. And uh, respect to Oda for having the call and hearing me out and seeing what I have to say. I really do appreciate that. Yeah. Yeah, like I said, we're cool. He apologized, and I mean, what 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 do I expect else? You know, I mean, he did apologize and said that he's never going to work with Vod again. I mean, I'm cool with that. Shout out to him. You know, or to read Runescape's Chronicles top comments. Oh, uh, I'll check it out. Give me a second. Did a bit of joined Rot and used Oda's name in a CC to recruit people. Snaked up mid finale for uh, Rot by doing the CC. From what we got told, Ditter Bitter said that it was Rot that made the CC, but he would just, uh, you know, went with it and did it as well uh, from his latest video. Posted the evidence on YouTube and then bragged. He did cover it and try hiding it, though. So let's not, you know, lie about that. That's that's factual. And then bragged about the win on YouTube and Twitter. He did brag about the win. Honestly, he should delete bragging about the win. Like, bro, fuck Rot. It's unfortunate that I joined them last year, bro. I did not know that they were just all this was going on for years, bro. So unfortunate that I just came in a multi scene like literally like two to three weeks ago. You can't complain now if people called you did or shitter, bro. You worked hard to earn that name. Yeah. Yeah. I understand. I understand.